Welcome to the hottest movie review on the internet today, the A-List Review. I am your host, the Game Changer, Wes Troop. And it's time for another one of my Wes's fave picks. My review of Superbad, coming up now. Yeah. Let me get my freak on. Two high school friends are invited to a party, and they have to pick up the booze. Let the antics ensue. So what did I think of Superbad? I thought it's a fun, great buddy comedy. The film is extremely funny, and it's full of great gags. It's also uh, very raunchy, so it's not exactly one to watch with grandma. Surprisingly, there are some sweet, more emotional moments here as well. While the story of the kids going to a wild party may seem familiar, there's definitely enough originality here for this to stand out. The script is full of classic lines that have been and will be quoted for years to come. It's funny to see how young the cast looks, except for Michael Cera. He looks about the same age in every movie. I love this cast, and it's full of some of my current faves. Jonah Hill and Michael Cera star as Seth and Evan, two best friends who are going through a bit of a spat after they don't get in the same college. They're fun and do a nice job, but what really makes this movie is its supporting cast. Christopher Mintz Place gained stardom here as his infamous role of as Fogel, also known aka McLovin. Yeah, if you've never heard of McLovin, you've got to be living under a rock. Seth Rogen and Bill Hader play two hilarious cops who befriend McLovin. My wifey, Emma Stone, is here in her first movie role, by the way, as Jules. And Martha McIsaac as Becca. Both of these girls are who our main characters want to get with. My only real complaint is that it's a little long of a runtime at almost two hours, but then again, most, most of the recent comedies have been long, so I don't know. After viewing Superbad again for the first time in a while, I can still say it's still one of my favorite comedies. So therefore, the A-list gives the film Superbad the rating of A-list approved. It gets the A-list. Seal of approval. So it's super good. <laughs> so if you want to check out Super Bad for yourself, you can by getting it through Netflix. And of course, you can find it at a DVD or Blu-ray store near you.